PWS Wrestling Fans, I am longtime independent wrestling fan Robert. The Empire State Strikes Back was a pretty fun show in Woodside, Queens earlier tonight. Here are the results. The show kicked off with Dan Moff defeating Trent Beretta in a very competitive opener. Next matchup saw the Heavenly Bodies to de defeat the Southside Players Club to become the number one contender to the PWS Tag Team Championship. Third match, a great brawl up in the bleachers, which saw Bonesaw defeat Necro Butcher. Very good match up there. Bonesaw definitely will be something in the wrestling business in the years to come. Uh, Flash Funk defeated Marty Jannetty, and uh, Flash, Too Cold Scorpio, whatever you want to call him, he could still go in the ring. In their six-way matchup, the Lifeguard defeated Pat Buck, Brian XL, Anthony Vigilante, Craven Varro, and Facade, Facade. Very good matchup. Didn't surprise me the lifeguard came out as a team from the TV show Baywatch. And uh, Pat Buck uh, bled, and uh, I guess something went wrong in that matchup, because I don't think Buck was planning on bleeding in the match. After intermission, the PWS mascot comes out, only to get uh, destroyed by the Big Deal Craig Steele, which led up to Fala defeating the Big Deal Craig Steele. In tag team action, Starman and the Drunken Swashbuckler beat Reality Check's Devin Moore and Kyle Reynolds. And then Scott Steiner defeats Davey Boy Smith Jr. in a good match. Uh, from there, the main event, uh, Kevin Matthews defeats uh, Homicide to retain the PWS Heavyweight Championship. Okay, on the personal notes, it was good having uh, Joe and Randy at this uh, show with me. Uh, good seeing Jennifer, Susie, Christine, Kathy. You sure can dance. The McNicholas family, Ricardo, Chris Fuentes, Clark, the number one reality check lover. Couldn't believe he was turning red and jumping up and down throughout the night. Uh, great seeing J.L. Chico. Uh, it was a guy sitting in the chairs in front of us where we were at in the bleachers, and he liked my work with my megaphone. I picked quite a show to take it out to, to use it. Uh, am I missing somebody? Hmm. Well, I definitely hope uh, PWS can come back to Woodside or at least somewhere in the New York City area someday. And uh, definitely, hopefully, more talent will be added on their shows. Uh, I... Hmm. I think that's it. All right, well...